Welcome back to System Shock. We're still trying to find a way down to the reactor level, and we are currently exploring the storage level to see if that will help us get there. So let's explore this area down here. I don't think I want to go down there just yet. Oh yeah, I gotta remember I have those new super fast boots. Oh my god. It's really hard to control once you get going. Storage 7. Oh shit. Wait for that to go away. I'm pretty sure that'll hurt me if I touch it. All right, let's switch over to the um, Teflon rounds. Ooh, ooh, hold on. I'm really hurt. Um, I have a med kit. There you are. Got it. Okay, now where's that cyborg? Because I definitely... Yep, there they are. God damn it. <laughs> I need to shoot slower. There. Have we encountered that? Oh, there's storage 5. Down there. Yeah, we'll save that for last. Oh, nice. Radioactive waste. Did you know that's how they dispose of radioactive waste in the real world, too? Robots are going to come out of these. He's going to roll up and there's just going to be something big inside him. something there's something here is it behind stuff you can see it on the mini map all 
Nah, I don't know. Probably not important. I thought that was a little bit suspicious. Looking for a secret. It's odd, there's no button down here for the repulsor lift, at least not within the lift itself, like there usually is. Maybe it's one of these buttons? That's a light. Oh yeah, that's for the lift. It's one of those. Oh shit. I don't, <laughs> I don't have the energy for it. Yeah, I'm actually low on batteries. I've only got one extra battery. Okay, I'm not going to use my last battery. Let's go to Teflon rounds. Let's EMP it. Oh shit, there's two of them. Okay, frag grenades work too. This is my last healing item. Oh, no, I have three more of those. Never mind. We're good. I don't remember when I got so many. Woohoo! Oh, hello. There's an item in there. You know, now that I have the boots, I could probably reach a lot of things that I wouldn't be able to otherwise, huh? Yeah. EMP. Ah! Ow. Target identifier V2. Do I have that? No. Displays a target's current objective. Holding... Oh. Okay, I've assigned a key to the target identifier, so I should be able to use it on an enemy and see what it can show us. These are microwaves. I wonder if Shodan needs them for something. Oh shit, I'm completely out of power. Yeah, no more batteries. Damn. Strange equipment. Table. I stashed an old 
prototype Enviro pack in. Oh, we need that. Some plastic. The Dorco to storage room 9 is 8. My log recorder is damaged, so I hope you get this. Okay, uh, for that code, you can make out the 8. 8, and then it sounded like they're about to say something I started with an F. So a 4 or 5. And then no idea what the last one is. But we can work with that. 8, 4, 5, and then, well, only 10 possible numbers for the last one. I bet you there's stuff up on these crates. Maybe not. Oh, I can't do my... I can't do my super sprint now that I have no energy. I don't think I need it. To get up here. <sighs> Open my head. Okay, maybe there's nothing. Whoa. Oh, shit. Huh? Where did it go? Did it just go further away? Yeah, okay. It's just straight up running away from me. There it is. These Teflon rounds are probably my best bet. I don't think any of my other stuff is good against armored. Oh, I got the big one. Oh, I'm almost out of Teflon rounds. I can't reload. Just got these seven. Oh, I got the drone too. Nice, and it's got some more Teflon rounds. And we got a battery pack. I would like some power, so I can use my abilities at least. Poor thing's still trying to fly. Oh right, my boots. Oh shit! <laughs> I thought I was hearing this thing trying to fly. No, there is actually one out here. Oh no, there's another one. Okay, no more Teflon rounds. Okay, what do I have that's good against armored things? So, armor penetration is 20% for normal rounds, which is horrible. Well, this thing, the Magnum has a penetration of 60%, which is quite good. Yeah, the shotgun with the Dragon's Breath rounds is terrible, but what about the other rounds? Are they the flechette rounds? 
Yeah, flechette rounds, armor penetration, 45%. Okay, not terrible. But I think the magnum's the way to go. Yeah, maybe I'll just use the magnum for a bit. Instead of the mini pistol. Well, I can leave the mini pistol there and put the magnum in place of the spark beam, because I don't have enough battery to use the spark beam. those beeps and boops. Oh, it's little scorpion thingies. Look at them. Oh my god, there's so many. There's at least six. Um, I don't want to... Whoa, I don't want to fall. Holy shit, that's a lot of blood. There's a pile of meat there, too. Huh? What? Is this music because of the scorpions, or is there something else? Okay, they're quite weak. I might as well pick them off with the pistol, just using standard rounds, because standard rounds are not worth much. Not precious at all. Oh, there's a repulsor thing right there. Another one down. I think there's just two left. I can take those out when I get down there. Oh. <laughs> Fatigue levels high, warning. Yeah, I think that's the least of my problems. I was flopping around dead, like having a seizure on the ground. Well, at least I'm going to come back on this floor. I don't know, I just kind of expect the game to have, like, a grapple, so I just thought even if I didn't make it, I would grab on. But I gotta remember, there's no grapple of any sort. There's no pulling yourself up the ledge. Alright, where are we at? Wait, I'm on maintenance. I thought I'd found somewhere on storage. Damn. Alright. Okay, we're back here. Before I go back to the spider bots, let's see what's over this way. Oh, shit. I love how things just love to twirl in this game. I'll get a twirl around. Yeah, this magnum's really good. Two shots and they're down. We have been on the other side of this, so this is just opening up a shortcut, I guess. Security 10%. We've got all the nodes already, so I think that means there's five more cameras. Hmm. 
Hmm. This looks like a nice little stair. There's got to be something up here. Yes. Osmium rounds for the Magnum. Could get over there, but according to my scanner, there's no item. So let's not risk breaking my legs and having a seizure again. What the heck is that? Got it. Whew. Didn't take a single point of damage. I feel good about that. What's that noise coming from? Those are the mines, aren't they? Two more battery packs. Could probably go back to using my spark beam now. Aw, oh, man. If you can't go up that way, then I'm guessing I have to go down that jump. And you probably can only make that with the boots. So maybe this is like a gate to make sure you have the boots before you can continue. Or wait, have we already been to the other side? The map makes it look like I have. Oh, right, just because we're below it. I'm kind of scared to do the jump. I'm worried I'm going to just smash my face and then take so much damage that I die. Wow, well, let's do it. <laughs> oh, fuck. Mm. Bye, bye, bye. Wow, Shodan was impressed, though. Thanks, Mom. Bye-bye! <laughs> ah! Okay, that almost killed me. Fuck. I don't know what I aggroed. Let's assume nothing. And let's explore somewhere else for a little bit until I can get some health back. Fuck you, Shodan. Oh! Okay. There must have been an assassin who sniped me, I'm guessing. Didn't even see him. Maybe before we go check that area out again, let's go check out storage room number one. The place that had all those spiders. Ah! 
I forgot I could lean. Oh, I hear a lot of legs. I think we've had a lot of respawns. That might be all of them. The spider bots, anyway. Something's chattering, and I don't know. I don't know what it is. Let's take it out before I loot anything. Oh, it might be up above. Oh, shit. What is that? What is it? Like, something just moved. It has to be up above. Oh my god, there it is. Oh my god, there's like fucking five of them. Oh, this is going to be really hard. I have like one hit point. Oh no. Holy crap. Okay, let's try the Magpulse rifle. I went and got it from the, the cargo lift. Now that I've got some ammo for it. This thing has 100% armor penetration, and it does magnetic, uh, what is it? Magnetic plus electric damage. It's basically made for exactly this situation. Huh? Huh? Nice. I think there's two more. When she said running firmware updates, do you really think it's a good time to do that in the middle of combat? There you are. Hold on. Do I have frags or am I completely out? Gassing them is not going to do anything. Yeah, I'm completely out of frags. An EMP does not do any damage, really. It just makes them weaker and disables them. Okay, that's all the ammo for that. I think there's only one more, though. I hear one more. I see the very tip of its head. Okay. 
Now we are finally freaking good. Oh, man. I thought this room would be like a nice reprieve from this. This is a hell of a room. What are they... What kind of loot do they usually have? That's shotgun rounds. Nothing. Oh, six, uh, six magnum rounds. Nice. Pulse cartridges. Oh, it's for the Magpulse rifle. Yes. Let's double pump it. There we go. Map shows there's an item here. Must be up above. Or is it like inside of here? Oh, it's probably that crate right there. There's a crate there, too. How are you supposed to make the elevator go down? I feel like that's a necessary safety feature that's lacking. Are you really supposed to just jump off? Ow! I guess you're not supposed to do this with one person. I guess it's a two-person job. Oh my god. Why are my knees so weak? Okay, for the thousandth time, where were we? Grenade launcher? Oh, hello. Oh, I'm not going to have room for you, am I? There, I put a marker down for it. There's nothing I'm comfortable getting rid of at the moment, so I'll have to come back for it. Alright, what do these do? Force bridge is disabled. Turning on force bridges? Yeah. Wait. Okay, that's wor working? Is it? Is it malfunctioning? Is it supposed to look like that? I don't know, it's a little suspicious. Yeah, the map shows the force bridges, doesn't it? So it looks like they're just flickering. Great. I'm gonna break my legs again, aren't I? Got it.
That's a something, I guess. Shodan really didn't want to stick it to surveillance, huh? I'm wondering if this is going to lead maybe behind all of this stuff that was really difficult and around where I got sniped. I guess where I got sniped was off um, this, this way. So it's over here. But it might lead to behind all of this, past the jump. Holy crap. Oh, the plastique. A crap ton of mag pulse cartridges. Flechette rounds. Mag rounds. Oh, some healing. Thank God. Oh, this is great stuff. Is this plastique gonna stack? Oh, man. I literally don't have a single space. <laughs> I wonder what I'm going to use it for. So far, I haven't found a use, but I'm certain it will come in handy. Oh, it looks like that's going to open the door to storage 4. Have I found storage 4 yet? Making sure nothing comes crawling out of there. Okay, at least I haven't unleashed something horrible upon the station. Alright, maybe we'll just, like, get rid of a couple cans or something. Toss out the isotope. I mean, who needs that? Okay, do you take up just one spot? Just one spot. Do you stack? You do stack. Oh, thank god. Oh, you only stack up to four. The focus charge in this package was to... Oh, the text goes out of the box. Um was designed to prevent theft of technologically sensitive corporate mining assets. These explosives will detonate after 10 seconds of being near high voltage electrical systems such as satellite communications equipment. So I think I have to use this as part of uh, a quest. So like, I don't think it's a general purpose explosive, is it? I can't put it there, can't put it in consumables. No, it's like a quest item. Maybe four is enough. Maybe I don't need more. I don't know, is there something I don't care about that I can get rid of? Food wrappers. There, I've got eight. And there's five more. If I want them, let's just mark it on the map. Plastic. And I think that's it for this area. I think I need to go to the big, scary, dangerous place now. Oh my god, I almost died. Shall I go over the jump, maybe, before I go east to the sniper? Let me put my healing here. And how about I just actually use one of them, huh? Yeah, all right, let's do the jump. Whew. 
level security, 6%. Oh, 4%. All right, now we don't have to take the jump. Oh, right, I've forgotten to use the target identifier. Doesn't show me anything about a dead enemy. Eight battery packs. Oh, I don't have enough room to take the gas grenades. Because I already have a stack of ten. Well, ten is plenty. <laughs> I think I'm hearing the fan. Yeah. Is there nothing I actually need here? I mean, with such an epic jump to get here, I, I thought this would lead to something. No, that's it. I suppose this works now? Nope. We'll have to take the jump if we want to get back there, but I don't see any reason to get back there. Let's check out the Sniper Bay. can't tell. Okay, whoa, yep. Saw some beams. Thank God for these boots. What is that switch going to do exactly? Is this an elevator or what is this? Ran out of power. Of course, that doesn't work. Oh, it is a lift. kind of just look like a crate. I was worried it would just box me up and ship me out or something. Shodan's done some pretty odd stuff. Oh, fuck me. Ah, Yeah. Man, from both ends. I would have been okay if it was just one end. Bastards. All right, let's go for this again. Mostly full health. Going with the mag pulse thing. Let's double pump it. I think I'm going to throw some EMPs at it, and I think we should try out our reflex um, consumable to give us slow-mo. Oh, shit! That went down a lot faster than I thought. Damn. Yeah, the EMP doesn't do any damage against it directly, but... Where does it say? 
armor reduction 20%. Yeah, so it does reduce its armor. Although, actually, now that I think about it, when you reduce the armor, if I'm using something like the Magpulse Rifle, which has 100% armor penetration, then it doesn't matter what their armor is, does it? I guess the Magpulse Rifle is just really good. And that's why I went down so quickly. Okay, what were you protecting down here? Oh, they got blown apart because that loader bot, I think, shot a missile at me. That's how I died. It blew all them up, too. Looks like that's how we get to the other side of the chasm. Some other items and... Oh, the upgrade station. Oh, that's above. Right. And the two items are from the two assassins we killed. Oh, healing things, yes. Does this one work? Yes. And they don't even flicker. So they're the ones with the assault rifles. I have a bunch of ammo for assault rifles. Still yet to actually find it, though. Do I have the room for everything? Just. And now I have no slots. So what do we got here? It's a choke mod kit for the shotgun. Oh, it probably makes the spread less. That'd be nice. I think I have the money for that as well. Twenty-eight, and I need twenty-five. Yeah. Yes, please. Upgrades it, decreases spread. This kit includes a choke that can be installed inside of the barrel of the SK-27 to tighten spread and increase damage. Wait, so it doesn't just decrease spread, it also increases damage? Or are they just implying that it increases damage because more of your shots will actually... Uh, more of the pellets or whatever will actually hit the target? I don't know. Heck yeah. Wait, what was the armor penetration before? I think it might have been like 40 or something, and now it's 50 and it's colored yellow, so it looks like it increased the armor penetration. Cool. Let's actually try it. So the crosshair has always been small. That hasn't changed. The spread was always a lot larger than the crosshair. Ooh, look at that. That's a pretty tight cluster. All right, well, I think I'm going to end the episode there, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we're going to check out Storage 6 and Storage 5.